What is up guys, VGA322 here with bonus video number one for the Banjo Kazooie Let's Play. Now, I partially showed this off before we headed into Click Clock Woods, I think. May have been before Rusty Bucket Bay though. Um, if you notice, there are, or if you remember that, uh, we ran into Cheeto. Now, Cheeto is a, one of Grunty's books, which will be explained when we go find him, but there are three uh, different locations that he is in around uh, Gruntilda's lair. And when you find him, he'll give you a cheat, as it were, <laughs> because it's the Cheeto pages. Now, uh, the reason I didn't get them while I was going through the game is because you really don't need them. Uh, they are helpful, but honestly not all that important. Now, why do I always think that those stupid boots are on this side? They're over here. Uh, our first one is actually going to lead us back to where the uh, Freezy Z Peak puzzle piece is. And uh, there's a couple things we're going to have to do here. Is First of all, we have to go back with Banjo. And then we have to go back again with the Crocodile. Now, uh, you can see see why that might be a little irritating. Although, the other one, the second one is kind of the same. However, the last one is probably the easiest one to get to, as I showed you. As you can see, Ice Boulder, break. But, if we try and get through here, we're too big. So, what we have to do is we have to head into Bubble Gloop Swamp and turn into the uh, Crocodile. So that's what we're going to go do, and I will be back with you guys in just a second when we do that. Alrighty, now that we are once again in our Crocker Rockin' form, we just head on back here. Uh, luckily, you know, it's not one of those things where if you break something, it respawns on you. I keep apparently running into the edge. But, uh, if we just come back, we can now gain access to that hole because we aren't, uh, too big. Of course, ice. Ha. Golden feathers. If only I could have found these when I was in Click Clock Woods. And this is going to lead us to Cheeto page number one. Cheeto, the spell book you have found. Magic cheats I have for you. Hey, book brain, what did you say? You better not give my spells away. Shouldn't you be under the ground? Which lost book finders bear and bird are spell they get? We sure do, bag lady. Come on, book boy, give us the spells. Only one spell Cheeto can tell. Enter the code blue eggs on sand castle floor in treasure trove cove world. Help you, it will. Thanks, Mr. Cheeto. Hidden in lair, other spell books are. Them you should find. Alrighty, guys, you heard the guy. So, we're gonna head to Treasure Trove Cove and go to the Sand Castle. So I will meet you guys there. Alrighty guys, so here we are in the Sand Castle in Treasure Trove Cove. Now, if you remember, considering it was about five seconds ago, um, Cheeto told us to enter Blue Eggs into the puzzle room floor. And if I could spell, this would be easier. Of course, I can't find anything. Always the trouble. As, as you saw when we were doing uh, the reverse challenge for this in, uh, I don't know if I can hit the same one. I guess I have to. Uh, when I was doing the reverse challenge in Gruntilda's thing. <laughs> and upon entering blue eggs, we will earn 200 eggs instead of 100. So we uh, doubled our maximum egg count. That allows you to cheat for extra eggs, won't help bear and chicken legs. Thanks, Grunzilla, but I think it already did. 
Alrighty guys, our next Cheeto book is going to take us to Mod, Mod, Mod to Mad Monster Mansion, um, because we need to turn into pumpkin form, and now that I realize that there's actually only one Cheeto book that doesn't require you to have a transformation to get, which I find pretty interesting actually. However, this one is in fact my least favorite one to go after. Uh, I can't remember which one it is, although I have a really good feeling I do know. Um, regardless though, it's my least favorite one to do, and you guys will understand that in just a moment. But we need to turn into Mr. Pumpkin. That should be a fun time. Hello, Mumbo. Sleeping away. The adventure's done, but nope, you're still chilling. Just chilling in your skull. Alrighty guys, now that we have the pumpkin, I will meet you guys just outside the level. Alrighty guys, so we are back in the area that uh, has the Godby's Valley puzzle. Now, we have to come to the left here, and this is the reason that I don't really enjoy this part is that this is so, so thin. And imagine me trying to come over here before I knew you were supposed to come over here as the pumpkin. I tried getting over here with Banjo. Yeah, that that didn't turn out very well. Now, this isn't the hardest part ever. And as you can see, uh, Brentilda is over here. And you can talk to her if you so will. But uh, once again, we need to be small with the pumpkin in order to get through here. And we can now come up to Cheeto. Cheeto, Bear, and Bird have found once more another spell they get. If one more page I see you turn, then Grunty shall Cheeto burn. Nasty witches, so code I shall tell. Enter red feathers on Sandcastle floor in the treasure trove cove. Alrighty guys, so once again we have another code that is going to allow us to go to the sandcastle so once again I will meet you guys back there in just a moment you know what let's 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 do this the easy way and thus we return to the treasure trove cove sand castle to enter red feathers onto the ground yeah so if you guys haven't guessed if the last one gave us a uh, double Eggs. Wonder what this one could possibly do for us. Could it possibly be giving us double red feathers? Oh gosh. Can't even imagine what would happen if the game gave us double red feathers. Which I think is 200 as well, but it might not be. 100, because the max is 50 for some weird reason. Alright, uh, our last one is going to take us to just outside of, uh, shoot, just outside Rusty Bucket Bay, which is the one that I actually shut off before, so I will meet you guys up over there in just a sec. Alrighty guys, here we go, heading towards our final Cheeto page. If we just come on up here, we have to activate the uh, switch first, it's going to raise the water, which means we have to come into where the Rusty Bucket Bay, oh no, it isn't, is it? Never mind, ignore what I just said. But we have to come into the first section of uh, this place to hit the uh, third water switch so that the water will rise. And in doing so, well, going backwards is a bad thing, so. In doing so, if we just come on down here to the red eyes of Doom and come through, uh, if we just swim to the surface, we will be able to turn back and discover a secret passageway, which is going to hold our final Cheeto page which uh, you guys know because I accidentally showed it off. It's not that one. It's uh, this one uh, right here. Bear and bird getting good at finding Cheeto, so another spell they shall have. That traitor book has pushed its luck, so in the, in the burning fire I'll chuck. Find Cheeto, which won't code, you must enter on sandcastle floor in Treasure Trove Cove is gold feathers. Hmm, I wonder what that could possibly mean. Hmm. 
All right, guys, I will meet you in just a moment when we get back to uh, Treasure Trove Cove so we can enter the final, um, you know, thingy, which is Gold Feathers. In. And if you, if you guys don't know what it does, well, that sucks to be you. You'll see in a second. Once again, we have returned to the Treasure Trove Sand Castle to enter the code Gold Feathers. Now, if, if if blue eggs gave us double eggs and and red feathers gave us double red feathers, I wonder what gold feathers could possibly give us. Hmm. I wonder. It is it is killing me, Dad. I just don't know what's gonna happen. That was weird. <sighs> Never gonna do that again. Anyway, um, yep. This is the final Cheeto code. Where is that H? There it is. And this is going to unlock for us. That's right, guys, would have guessed 20 gold feathers you get. New maximum 20 is. Gold feathers, you may have 20, but bruises, you'll still get plenty. Eh, I was pretty weak, but whatever. Anyways, guys, that is, uh, every that's everything for this bonus video. That is the Cheeto pages. And I know that this part was a little short, but there wasn't too much to do. Um, next time, we will be doing the final bonus video that I know of, at least. And um, that one will be a little more interesting. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it yet. I may just go get them. However, I may go a little into depth. It depends on what I feel like doing. But for now, this is VGA322 signing out. I hope I will see you guys next time. But until then, peace.